Welcome back. You watching the Realest Channel on YouTube, man. Luciano TV. Shout out to everybody within the sound of my voice. I hope y'all having a beautiful, prosperous week. It's going down. people going in Chick-fil-A yesterday. I need to get a battery charger. You like it? Little four-wheeler. That's nice. <laughs> Car? Say bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Yeah. Ah. 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 Hey, look at this one. You wanna go fast in this one? Vroom, vroom. No. He's freaking out. No. No. I have one at home. This little boy didn't want to stay in the shopping cart, so I am carrying him. And every single day, it seems like he weighs more and more, you little fat butt. We swore we were just coming in here for a couple of things. And we ended up spending over a hundred bucks, you guys. That's why I don't like going to Walmart. Lucky though, lucky looking right, you guys. That's all me, that's all me. You looking nice, babe. New era hippie. I always be talking on this camera thinking I'm recording, I ain't even recording. We did a whole, when was that? Like yesterday or two days ago, we did a whole five minutes on the camera thinking I'm recording, I wasn't even recording. Anyway, happy birthday, Smiley9697. Today's your birthday. I hope you have a beautiful, blessed day. God and bless you. Wish you many more to come. I'm finna go to the studio. Kelly gonna make some chicken enchiladas for lunch, and I can't wait. Y'all, I am so freaking sleepy. Like, it don't even make no, I, like, it don't even make no sense how tired I be. I was tired yesterday too, man. Editing these vlogs, man. Can I get some love for editing these vlogs every day? Just, just editing vlogs every day is a job in itself. Man, it takes like two, two and a half hours to edit a vlog. And doing that every single day, sitting in front of that computer editing a vlog. That's hard work. I ate my marganito, the ones we bought yesterday at that, at that uh, panaderia place in the Alamo house. I know a lot of y'all are always asking what is the name of that place. That place is called the Alamo House. I don't know. We call it the Alamo House, but I know that that's not the actual name. Um, but anyways, it's on Berry Road. So yeah, y'all should go check it out if y'all are in Houston. I'm drinking my coffee. I made me some coffee because, you know, you can never go wrong. Like you can't eat a maranito without dipping it in the coffee because that's that's where it's at like whenever it gets soft and moist that's you know that's just that's life right there i am going to be making enchiladas today the green enchiladas um i do have everything i need i just don't have the queso fresco but it is okay i'm gonna make sure i vlog it for y'all that way if y'all ever want to make enchiladas the Lou channel tv way y'all can it's easy it does take some work but they are delicious and this is a disclaimer nobody ever in my life in my whole entire life ever taught me how to make enchiladas the way i make enchiladas i literally learn through trial and error it is the way that i like them and so i'm kind of excited for that i hear lucky coming back in the house so I'll be back with y'all whenever I'm ready to cook. 
candy paint, it froze the bogus, my bad homeboy, it's a Houston thing. Shooters come from Mexico, I drop a bag on your username. My plug love me, I'm good money, he know that I don't lose the cane. Hit, hit the button, open up garage, and foreign cars, I'm backing out. Before I'm broke, I cut the coke, who want the smoke, I pass it out. My number low, so my money swap, motherfuckers know I don't play. Up, up in the club, I'm iced up and ordering rose. Strapped up, don't act dumb, I'm tipping foes on Antoine. Ball fade, no man bun, you niggas tripping, I'm laughing. Count money and living lovely, watch Lucky, he's sipping bubbly. Spitting game, don't interrupt me. Fuck a hater, my bitches love me. <laughs> Holla at me, I could put you on. And this a road. Hey, hey. Shout out to Cassette Coast. We got an album coming soon, my boy Coast. Y'all look out for that. Oh, y'all want that solo shit? I got you, man. Ain't too many essays round this bitch gon' do this shit like I do. My money crazy, they love to hate me. It's lucky, baby, I'm not you. Got a line wrapped around the building when I come through for that pop-up. Foreign car, I been a star, I'm sliding by with my top up. Lemon haze, I'm in a daze, that 40 cal on side of me. Watching out for them boys plotting, better think twice about robbing me. I be the man that feed the fam, gotta make sure that they see me again. When I'm in the streets, gotta make sure that I make it back to Gigi and them. That's the fam, I'm stacking bands, got big body, no caravan. I know these niggas see it, but they acting like they didn't. Got a billboard in your city, they like, nah, -uh, no, he didn't. Now this bitch ain't rented, ballin' like night in it. Diamonds when I'm grinning. Look, mama, I did it. Sticking to this shit, I know. Can't wait till my nigga time can't get home. Steak and shrimp, face on the blimp. We taking trips, we not at home. Fly. I try to tell them I'm fly, fly. I wake up and I get high, high. Get that money, no lie. I think I'ma say this shit for me, man. I don't think I'ma sell this to none of y'all, though. I think I'ma say this one for me. This one, this one right here go kinda hard. I might save this for my own shit. Hey. What's up, honey boo boo? I'm like, shit, I gotta wash dishes. <laughs> what you got going over here? That smell good. You gonna make some enchiladas? No. Oh, you happy because you heard Dada? So I'm trying to potty train him, and I set him on the toilet, and he was like, shh. He has pull ups on. What's up, baby Houston? Sprinkle me. <laughs> so as promised I am going to be making my enchiladas on camera so make sure you grab your little notebook and take notes we're going to get right into it right now I am boiling the chicken I use chicken thigh just because it's easier to like shred and cut and it looks about ready. I'm actually already um, basically shredding it by using a fork and a knife. So you're basically just chopping it up. And what I mean by chopping it with a fork and a knife is just, is just like this. Right, 
So here is all my chicken already shredded or cut up, whatever you want to call it. And now it is ready to be seasoned and ready to get rolled up into the tortilla. So I'm just gonna be seasoning it with salt, some chicken powder, and some black pepper, as you all see right there. So we're gonna add salt. I never really measure the amount of seasoning. I always just basically buy it. So go some of the chicken powder so that the ch chicken is seasoned. Now, I'm just gonna mix it all in this bowl. That way it's all seasoned, not just the top. All right, step number two. I know a lot of people like to dip the tortillas in the green sauce, but I have, I have realized that it just doesn't work for me. Whenever I dip it in the tortilla, they either end up breaking or as I'm rolling it, they end up just like messing up and breaking and then all the chicken falls out. So what I do is, y'all ready? So I don't heat up the salsa or dip my tortilla in it. What I do is I mix sour cream and the green enchilada sauce together to make a creamy sauce. And then y'all are about to see like so. A lot and then I am going to grab my sour cream Ex excuse Houston he's in the background um, but so I basically just start squeezing some um, sour cream in there I mix the sauce to where it gets a little thicker and not so watery yep. That's good. But now you have to get to rolling your enchiladas up. So I'm gonna make 10 enchiladas. So I'm gonna warm these up just a tiny bit. So 30 seconds and then flip them another 30 seconds. Okay, as y'all can see, it is steaming. The tortillas are warm and they are soft. So here we go. So this is our very last one. And voila! All right, so I just finished rolling up the tortillas. So now what we're gonna do is, y'all remember this salsa right here? Basically, and pour it all over to where all of your enchiladas are basically drenched in this sauce all right so the last step is basically adding cheese on top we have a problem though because i don't have a lot of cheese so we're gonna try and stretch it and make it um enough for all of these enchiladas and in this case i am using mozzarella cheese cheese is very important you guys so i'm a little sad but they're still gonna be bomb All right, and as I was rolling everything up, I was preheating the oven. We just pop them in there, and they should be ready in about 10 minutes. Ooh la la, can y'all smell that? I wish I could smell that. It looks like it was just enough cheese, because it's melted and it looks so good. So I'm gonna pull these out right now and we're gonna dig in. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. This 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 lunch and dinner or just lunch? I'm gonna dress the enchiladas with some lettuce and avocado. How many do you want? I want three. You should have cooked some rice on the side. Why do you have time? Y'all wanna know how I make my enchiladas? I'll tell you how I make my enchiladas. I get a can of chili, like hot dog chili, and I pour it on top of there with some shredded cheese. 
So we're gonna but I heat up the chili though. So I'm gonna dress them with some lettuce. And then when I met Kelly, she came over here and made these enchiladas. I was like, hold on, this is like some restaurant style enchiladas over here, baby. Put one more, and then here you go. Bam! I hope y'all having a great day. I got to go. Let me get a taste test. Luci Luciano TV taste test rating. Let's see. Y'all think it's going to be five stars? Y'all missing out, man. Oh, let me get one of them jalapeno. My enchilada recipe, and before we go, I want to give a huge shout out to Kool Aid, Pretty, and the babies. Thank y'all so much for watching. Thank y'all so much for showing love, commenting, subscribing, and hitting the like button. See y'all tomorrow. You wore that to school? Yeah. You was represented. Did anybody say anything about your shirt? No. No one said nothing. No. Your teacher ain't say what that is. No. Hi. Hi, dude. Why is the light it's starting? these vlogs because I get home so late so I know how mom cooks some uh, enchiladas I don't really like those type of enchiladas I'm not even gonna lie to you so um I'm just gonna make me some corn dogs and Titi's gonna make her some ramen still has it in the package bro look at him I on the other hand am ready to eat some freezer food <laughs> we got our classic this is a classic right here a classic Classic. Did I say, did I mention that these are a classic corn dog, bro? Look at that. Mm, made with real honey, bro. Mm. I'm about to grab these bad boys. Don't worry about the Similac. Get those. What I'm going to do now is um, you want to um, uh, close the fridge. Get your corn dog. Um, come over here. Gigi. And then is um, making ramen. Look at him. And I'm being a savage. Well, yeah. I'm gonna teleport. Hi. I'm gonna teleport in here. Bro, Leah, you're crap. Sorry about that. That was just little. I'm gonna get two of them. One state fair corn dog. Two state fair corn dog. What you wanna do is. From there, you want to um, 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 put the camera back so you can see yourself, and then um, close, and then uh, and then just slide right off, and then you bite it. I'm just kidding, guys. I didn't even close it. Then what you want to do is you want to place it perfectly right here, and then what you're gonna do, you're gonna put it in there for like a minute, and you flip it. 30 seconds, flip them, flip them, flip them, flip them, flip them, flip them, until they're delicious. And yeah. All right guys, I just got my food. I ate my corn dogs, they were delicious, I forgot to vlog it, my bad. Anyways, um, well I don't even know what they did, I haven't even seen the vlog, but I hope y'all enjoyed. And comment if y'all wanna see more of Silky Slam, bro, cause um, um, cause like all um, like what's about to be the week leo what are you doing it's about to be the weekend so i should be on the vlog i feel like going to papa seafood again that was delicious guys y'all should really go check it out um yep and peace